Hi, I'm Stanley Brown, owner of Robust Wine Bar here in Webster Groves, Missouri. Uh, thank you for joining us. We have Camille Cox with Palmar Winery here. We're excited to have her. Um, Camille, I just want you to give me a little bit of background. Um, what makes Palmar special? You know, it's known as a bit of a cult wine. These wines are not inexpensive. Why do people pay this kind of money for these wines? And I kind of get some of it, but if you could explain it, I think it'd be good. And just explain a little bit about the wines and what you do at the winery. Thank you. Well, first of all, thank you for having us. We our appreciate pleasure. it. Um, I think what makes Palmeyer so special, number one, is our owner, Jason Palmeyer. Okay. Um, to know Jason is to love Jason, and the wines are big, full, robust wines, just like our owner, Jason Palmeyer. Um, we're very proud of the wines because we feel at Palmeyer there's something for each and every person and each and every person's palate. Um, there's eight wines under the Palmeyer label, five being the Palmeyer wines, and then three, they're to declassified Palmeyer, called our Jason wines. Jason, yeah. um, we make Palmyre. two Chardonnays underneath the Palmeyer label, a Pinot Noir a Merlot and a proprietary Bordeaux blend. Which and is we, your flagship. Flagship. Well, yeah. well there's two schools of thought on that. If you ask Jason, he says the prop red. If you ask Erin Green, our current winemaker, she'll say the Napa Valley Chardonnay. Oh, okay. And then we have the Jason ones that are the um, Jason Chardonnay, Jason Pinot Noir, and Jason Red. So I think it's a lot too to do with the fact that the properties that we own, we own a piece of property on Atlas Peak. We, they own 72 acres up there. They grow Cab, Chard, Cab Franc, Petit Verdot, and Malbec. And the Palmyres also own 30 acres on the Sonoma Coast, uh, which 24 are dedicated to the Pinot Noir making process and 24 to Sonoma Coast Chardonnay. Um, Sounds like a good program. It is, it is. And, and the best part about Palmyre, too, is I think the pedigree of winemakers that we've had in the past. Um, past winemakers included Randy Dunn from Rand uh, Dunn Family Vineyards, sure. then Ed Levy, who went on to Harlan fame, then Helen Turley, and now our current winemaker, who really is just making incredible wines. She's been our winemaker. Um, this is her 11th vintage. It's Erin Green, Green. Right. and she, this is her 17th year at Palmyre, and she's just an outstanding winemaker. We can't stand up about her, and I think that's really what drives up the prices because we're so fortunate, along with all those other things that I just mentioned. Sure. I mean, Palmyre has a great name out there. It garners many awards and great scores and all the press. So, uh, congratulations. We're just happy to have you here at Robust. Oh, well, thank and, uh, you. We're looking forward to the tasting night. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Stanley Brown signing out. Signing out. I love life. I love wine. I'm thirsty for more. Cheers.